Some Oklahoma Vietnam veterans are honored to have a partnership with Greyhound Bus Lines that's now lasted for five decades. The veterans all served in the same Army helicopter unit and the Greyhound was their logo. News on 6's Kristen Weaver shows us how the company is honoring these men 52 years later. It was a tribute all these men from the 240th Assault Helicopter Company couldn't have imagined. An original Vietnam War helicopter restored to fly again, and a special Greyhound bus wrapped in honor of their unit. The, the aircraft that carried the troops were, were the Greyhounds. Morris Miller was a helicopter crew chief during the Vietnam War. After someone from the unit wrote to Greyhound bus lines, the company donated their running dog decals for the helicopters and vehicles, all for free. A beautiful partnership was formed. Our motto was, go Greyhound and leave the flying to us. This year at the unit's reunion in Michigan, Greyhound unveiled this bus, which features the helicopter unit and pictures of the soldiers. It'll tour the U.S. for the next year. Many men in the unit are from Oklahoma. I'm glad to be here. Ridge Smith was a Greyhound for only 10 days before he was shot 11 times, twice in the head. We flew in and found out that that was not an American body, it was a Viet Cong. And uh, I got shot, my, my crew chief was killed. Smith spent 10 months in the hospital. He went on to serve another 12 years in the Army and became a captain. Bob Tippett was another Greyhound. I was shot down in, in March of 68, and we were down for five days in the jungle. Tippett survived and served for 28 years in the Army. He says he will never forget those memories. Over the years, we've kind of tried to keep together as a family. We, we all carry something, a hurt inside, and we need each other for that support. <clears throat> Kristen Weaver, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.